Well, how do there, chums? As I, Captain of the Steves, and today, chums, I'm jumping into No Man's Sky over onto our group sort of event that we called Light No Fire, and I'm going to be doing some base tours. And um, I'm jumping over to I think Cynical's area of space and uh, taking a look around and seeing which base I think is the best inside of this Crayola Kingdom. Yeah, and so then Cynical can award. That person with the Grand Architect Award. The reason that we're going to be doing tours on each other's sections is to sort of like remove any animosity between who's the best build, you know, that sort of thing. Okay, well, let's jump on over into game, shall we? Okay, jumps. So here I am. I'm, I'm in my normal save because I did build a hub base here in my normal save. And I'm just going to use my shifty ship to fly to all these different places. So I need to find Cynical's hub zone area. So that's the 07 Brew Crew over there. So I don't want to go to my own area. Heck no. Right, so over there we've got Husband Vidal Hovel. What the fudge is that when it's at home? Now, we didn't ask people to put, like, a prefix in there. Light No Sky uh, is, is R.I.P. dead now. Okay. Now, I'm not seeing many base markers. Um, so this could be a little bit difficult. Light No Sky attempt. Yeah, I'm not seeing much going on here, people. Right, hold on. There's a teleporter up there. Let's see if somebody's conveniently named their base, like Creola Kingdom, so I can at least find the bases. Or else this might be extremely difficult to do. Okay, here we go. Into here. And if I hit other bases, this should be all the light no sky type ones. Brew Crew. There we go. Brew Crew. EMP. So that's Empire. That's uh, that's uh, that's Rice's area. I'm looking for somebody inside of the uh, Crayola Kingdom. I'm not seeing any. Not seeing any there. They've not rendered in, have they? Golden City. That looks freaking awesome. That does. Fable Pilgrim. 07 Brew Crew. It only seems that the 07 Brew Crew and Empire were the only ones that put anything inside of their freaking titles. So I'm a little bit stuck, to be honest. I don't think I'm going to be able to review any of Cynical's ones. Apart from Cynical's base, which I saw, which was like a giant freaking castle. Yeah, first chapter, he was in my team. Pretty much all of these are bro Brew Crew. I recognise them from Brew Crew. Okay, um, I'm a little bit stuck, people. Well, chums, I've tried swapping game modes and now I'm flying up to the actual station. So I was in creative mode when I first arrived. I've now swapped it into normal mode. And I'm going to go check the portal terminus. It shouldn't make a difference, the game mode. Sometimes going up to the station can force render bases. So that's why I'm trying the station. So if I go to other bases, let's have a look if we see any new ones. Okay, crash pad, that's that's new, but I don't know whether that's in this system. That's pretty cool, I love that. That's really clever. Yeah, I like that one. Okay, cool. We've got spa resort. Yeah, this is this system. Safe haven. Hmm, shop for free. Terra Gigantus, very nice. Brew crew, Golden Citadel. Eastlix base, work in progress. Watch your outpost. Griffox Games. Unicronus Combined Mountain Fortress 2. I'd... No, I'm not seeing any of the Crayola Kingdom's bases inside of this. And I'm going to struggle to do a tour. I am. Uh, I am definitely going to struggle to do a tour. You know what? I think we might have to just sort of... Um, Maybe say, well, season one was a bit of a write-off when it comes to the Grand Architect reward. I mean, I know those that built awesome bases in my own brew crew area, but it might be unfair for me to bestow a title onto the Grand Architect for somebody inside of my own area, you know? And uh, I think Ricey and Cynical feel the same way. But if they also have this same issue, of not being able to see bases rendering, 
I mean, we, we know there's, there's loads of bases here. Freaking loads of them. The only thing I can think of doing is to quit out to mode select and go back in with the actual one that I did here, which was the Light Nose Fire Brew Crew, this one here. Uh, yeah, I'll see if that's any good. OK, right, well, I've arrived at Cated at my own base. Now, just so I can get around easy, I'll stick in a blaze teleporter. I'll stick it right there for now. Yeah, fudge it and go there. And I'm just going to connect it up to the power supply that I've got sitting out there. OK, right, let's set up this base terminus then. Let's uh, let's see if, what bases appear now. Other bases. OK, I'm seeing oh, Daniel Hipley. OK, cool. I don't know what faction Hipley was in. Ah, Santos Rest, that's 07 Brew Crew. Captain Loco, don't recognise Captain Loco, but he could have been Brew Crew. Who knows? No one's actually put any sort of markers on here. MB, Light No Sky. I don't know who MB is either. Anarchy, Sting Noir. AV Empire, there's the Empire base there, Fire Lily, Castle Anthrax, that sounds like something that would be over in the um, Coriola Kingdom, doesn't it? Broken Skull Tavern on the hill, nice. 07 Brew Crew, Constriction Camp Delta, I like the look of that, that's pretty cool, by Mickey Head. The Empire, I mean, that, that's obvious, so that's the Empire, freaking heck. Brew Crew. Okay, Light No Sky Portal. Dragon Breeding Emporium by Miyogi. I'm seeing a lot more on this save, so this has worked. Okay, I'm not seeing any that are marked as being Creole Kingdom. Grump of the Hill. Great Stone Shore. You see, if I can just find one that's Creole Kingdom, it will put me in that area. Grey Gargoyle, all the Watchtowers. Well, there's the Empire. Britannia, I know that's the Empire, PSB. Public Beach with Horrors. CK Reigns Gateway, Broken Brittle. They look the same, look. Isn't that weird? We've got Spectators Rock, Brew Crew, Tribase, Scar... It looks like only me and Ricey have been labelling as. Um, Construction Terror, James MC, K Meldwell, 07 Dragon Tower, cool. Brew Crew, Brew Crew, all of Brew Crew, Crash Pad, uh, Brew Crew, Temple Resort, Swamp Lands by Burger Lips. Yeah, this is. Um, not easy. Unless Cynical asked his guys to dismantle all of his bases. Who freaking knows? Well, what I could do is I could go over to one that I know for sure is Empire. Because I know all of my own ones. So if I end up in Empire, then the area that I fly to, then I, I know by freaking default that it's probably not Empire. It's going to be, you know, Cynical's. So I'm going to have to do it by elimination. So here we go. We'll go to Good Guys Free, who's over in the Empire. Let's just walk there. Zoom. OK, well, I've arrived, Kated, and I can see quite a lot of bases over here that are like six hours away. Eight hours away. So I would imagine all of those ones over there might be the brew crew, uh, not the brew crew, be Cynicals. Because we've got these over here. Great, that's 11 hours away. Well, maybe not then. Oh, yeah, we've got Combined Fortress at 13 hours away. Brew View, that's 30. That's the Brew Crew over there. That's Brew Crew. Okay, that says AV. That's, that's Brew Crew. Yep, that's all Brew Crew over there. So that's Brew Crew over that way. Well, the fudge is over there then. Canaries West. Ah! There we go. Creola Kingdom. CK. 
Okay, we're heading to a CK Criolla Kingdom. We've found one, people. We've found one. Right, I'll see you over in the Criolla Kingdom. Oh, hold on. What the fudge? Oh, it looks like freaking good guys has gone and stuck a base saying Empire <laughs> in the Criolla Kingdom. You sneaky get, but that didn't make it easy for me. Okay, right. So here we go. This is our first Criolla Kingdom base, I think. I hope. Um, it might not be. But look at this. I mean, we were supposed to be building in keeping with Light No Sky. And I'm seeing biodomes with a shed load of Nip Nip. Look at that. And loads of Sack Venom. Daniel Hipley built this, I guess. And that's a no-no. He's got Sack Venom there. Well, Cynical didn't do too well in the collecting missions, but looks like he had that sitting right under his frickin' nostrils all this time. Right, well, we've got Canary's Rest over this way. I'm, I'm not even going to rate Daniel Hipley's, because Daniel Hipley broke all the rules known to man. Okay, let's head on over this way, then. Yeah, this is definitely Cynical's um, area. I saw this base in use. It's got loads of underground tunnels and all sorts of stuff. I really quite like this one. I've already been in this base. I've already gone round it, I believe. Yeah. Very cool. I think maybe... Did I, did I already do this this video? It's just that people have been hitting me up saying, Captain Steve, when are you going to do the base tours? Maybe I already have. Because I, I remember going round this and saying, yeah, this is quite cool. This is quite nice. But I don't think everything is rendering in. Ah, maybe I cut it short. Maybe I was waiting till after the event. I'm just having serious deja vu right now, people. But anyway, this is Canary's Rest or Canary's Kingdom or whatever it is. But it's very cool, isn't it? I like this one. That's quite a satisfying look to the outer exterior. And yes, I think that's quite in keeping with the light, no sky sort of remit. And I like this little um, atrium that they've got here with some plants growing inside. And it's it's also like star bulbs. That's okay. That's fine. Yeah, very nice. I think that one's quite cool. And so, so far, that's my favourite base. Even though I've only looked around like two. And Daniel Hipley's disqualified. Right, okay. Um, what's over here then? Okay. Uh, that's only... I thought Todd MC was on my site. Dang you, Todd MC! All right, let's go on. Let's go on over here then, and let's go and have a look at Todd's base. I'll be there in a sec. Right. Well, this planet has no trees normally, and look at all these trees that have been placed outside of here. Extra bonus points for putting in freaking trees. Heck yes, nice. I like that. Okay, we've got a little fire thing going on here. Holy mackerel! This is cool, isn't it? Okay, got a staircase going up here. Very awesome. Okay, and a staircase going down here too. Todd MC, dead now. Yeah, he's got a galactic trade terminal hidden under there. Sneaky little rabbit. Let's head on up here then. Cool. Yeah, it's, it's pretty darn sneaky, isn't it? Pretty nice. As far as bases go, that's, that's all right, isn't it? Heck yeah. That's pretty cool. Right, so Todd MC, very nice. I like your flaming skulls, mate. Freaking lovely. Heck yeah, it's just like some kind of King Kong. Right, oh, so there's Daniel here, please. That one over there was Canary's Rest by Bupti. And this one's by James. Okay, what's this over here? That's only 700 U's. I'd imagine that's still created a kingdom. I'm going to need my ship to get up there. How the fudge did you build so high? Oh, look, there's another base just there, actually. What's that one? Construction Camp Delta. Let's go and have a look at the old Construction Camp by Mickey Head. Holy fudge, mate. It looked like a freaking greenhouse as I was approaching. But now that I'm here, this is massive base. Okay, we've got a landing pad. Lightner's Sky Challenge. Ow! Something freaking bit me. Okay. Let's head in. Okay, this is weird. 
Okay. It looks like it's still under construction or something. There's a site to site teleporter in here. It says it's got no power. Hmm. Oddity. All right, well, maybe I can't see it in its full... Oh, hold on, let's, let's charge it up. Right, there we go. Now let's see where we go. Oh, fudge, I'm underneath the ground. Ah! And then I got ported out. Okay, I don't know what's going on there, but I don't really want to risk doing that again. Light No Sky Challenge. Let, let, let's, let's try it once more, just in case there's something awesome in there. I do like the look of this. I mean, it's got a very Japanese type look about. Where's the site teleporter gone? It's frick. Oh, there it is. Okay. Right. Let's just stand. Ah, oh, dang it! I can't stay under the ground. It doesn't like it. All right, fine. Okay, that's that's that base then. Now let's go into camera mode. Let's have a quick look at it. I like the roof. I really do. That's that's quite cool. It's got a Japanesey type look to it, hasn't it? I do like all the um the scaffolding outside and what's going on there. It looks like it's something that's under development that you're not really supposed to see. Oh look, there's a staircase going down there anyway. Something sneaky going on in there, isn't there? Something sneaky. Don't know what. But yeah. Interesting. I don't think I got to see it in all of its glory, though. Right. Okay. I was going to call my ship in, but I can't see the console to do it. Okay. Well, we need to get up there somehow. Let's go and have a look at that one. So, let's call in my old shippity ship. Boom. I'm going to fly on over. It's probably not got a landing pad. Well, my jetpack's not tough enough to get to the top of that. So I don't know how we're going to see it. If if there's no landing pad there, I might be a little bit scuppered. Where's it bloody gone? Okay. I've lost it. Oh, there it is. Zoom. Am I going to be able to land here? This looks pretty darn snaz. Yeah, let me land. Ah! I can't land. And I don't think my jetpack's good enough to get me up here, so I've got to hope that it lands me somewhere on here. Go on, land, you know you want to. There we go, we landed right on the peak of there. Right, here we go. Okay, is a, there's a big storm, so maybe it might be able to get there, up there with my jetpack. It's highly unlikely, though. Oh, we're there. I think the storm helped. Oh, there is a staircase, though. Look, there's a little staircase here. So who did this one? Elan Paul. Elan Paul. All right. We head on in. Oh, you've got a little flaming rock going on there. Lovely little barbecue. Very nice. Very cool placement. Very clever. Very apt indeed. And very in keeping with the sort of the theme of light no sky, I guess. Is that a door? It is. Okay. That's pretty nice. It's cosy, isn't it? I love all this pathways that you've done in a, a really cool style -y. There's a good chance I'm going to fall through it because, you know, that's the type of guy I am. Okay, well, that's pretty cool. Is there any other bases in close proximity? Mm -mm. A thousand views that way. Is that still Cynical's territory? Really? Okay, we'll head over there then. We'll have a look. And see whose base that is. Oh, I think this is Good Guys Freeze base. And I think they're part of Empire. And I think they just put up a big placard saying Empire, didn't they? So I think he raided this area. So I don't think that's a true base. What's this little marker here? That's the one I was just at. Okay. Right, so what have we got over here? Two hours away. That can't be Cynical's area still. One area. Uh, one air, hour. Five hours. See, I'm in a ship right now, so it, it should. Eleven minutes. I don't really know what's going on. We need to actually set a better sort of setup, don't we? Because I think this is Cynical's area here. 
And of course, I, I've been to all of these now. Yeah, six hours away. That that can't be it. I think I've I think I've gone and looked at all the ones that I think are in Cynical's area, and I'm just going to have to apologise if not. Because I think all those over there are Empire. I think. We're going to have to come up with some sort of better way of labelling our bases because it's not simple. Look, oh, oh hold on. Mm. Yeah, it's not simple, is it? There's one more down here. CK Reigns Getaway. Let's go to this one. Let's have a quick look at, look at this. Well, this is nice, like a little biscuit barrel. What's that one over there, anyway? Ten minutes that way? Don't know. Right, we'll land here then. Right out. Oh, this is quite cool. Don't know whether the top of the biscuit barrel's rendered in completely. But this one is Rain Man seven 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 nine 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 blah, 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 blah. him or her. I mean, it says man in the title, but you, you never know these days, do you? Right, there's no lights. There's no. There's some lights, but there's not a lot of lights, is there? Right, let's go into camera mode. Let's put the sun in the sky. There you go. Big freaking light. Okay. Still freaking dark. Okay. Can't see much going on in there. Let's have a look at this little biscuit barrel on the outside. It looks like there is a walkway through to the biscuit barrel. And then a staircase going up that takes you to the roof. So it's like a little lookout. Okay. Let's um let's go through then. Let's see if we can work out. Oh god, this is totally dark. I can't see my hand in front of my face. Okay. Um we're just gonna fly up. Okay, I think I'm halfway. You need lights. You need freaking lights. Okay, head on up here. If I had lights and a few extra points, because I'd be able to bloody see. But yeah, that's that's all right. That's not bad, is it? That's okay. Yeah, that's 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 pretty cool actually. Nice little lookout, little defensive structure, I suppose. But yeah, I've got a feeling that there's a lot of other bases that haven't rendered in, or perhaps you know. Cynical's team spreaded their wings a little bit and didn't actually all build in the same area. Don't know, don't know, but I think it's going to have to go to that Canary base. I think the Canary base just pips it for me, people. Close second was probably that one up on that big sort of hill that had the gnarly floors that I was worried I was going to fall through. But yeah, pretty darn sweet. I was going to see if I could just spot the one that I was on about. Uh, it's somewhere over here, isn't it? That's Daniel Hipley's base. It's this one that I like the most. This one here. Canary's Rest. CK. This, guy, this one here. I think this is actually a lady that owns this base. I could be wrong. But uh, yeah, that base there is, is the one that I'm going to say is my favourite amongst the Criolla Kingdom. So, uh, if Cynical agrees... Uh, I would say this one deserves Grand Architect for Cynical's area. So if I just go into camera mode, put the sun in the sky. This base here, if you own this base, I'm declaring you as the Criolla Kingdom's Grand Architect. There you go. Okay, peeps, you can see that I'll try my best to tour as many bases as I could inside of the Criolla Kingdom. Well, it looks like maybe one more is just rent. No, 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 that's the one I looked at. Had the really cool roof. But yeah, it's it's a bit of a weird one. Um, we're going to have to come up with better naming conventions in series season two. There's a lot that we've learned that we're going to do better in season two. So sorry, people. And also, you know, base rendering and uh, loading. As you can see from my very initial video and part of this video, there was no bases showing up at all. I nearly gave up. So different saves, you see different things. Work that one out. Freaking weird. Anyway, people, that that's that's me pretty much done. I'm going to be ending off. Well, we are looking for a planet to do season two on. I've got a video coming up soon of me doing my own initial hunt. I found a couple of candidates. I've screwed them over to Cynical and also Ricey. But we have yet to found something that we've gone, actually, yes, this ticks all the boxes. We've, we've found things that tick some boxes. Like it might have the flying fauna, but then it's got mushrooms all over the planet. 
or it hasn't got any of the flying fauna, but it's got trees, it's got an awesome landscape, and it's an interesting planet. We need to find something that's a medley of the two. Oh, and then Ominous Gaunt found a really cool planet, but it's that big that all the waypoints are too spread out. So it's very hard to get from places, even on flying creatures. It was taking me, what, 14 hours to get from one waypoint to another because the planet was too large. So there's quite a lot that we need to actually go through and go, yeah, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Oh, and then I found a perfect planet. All the waypoints were lovely. Had aggressive sentinels. Oosh! Really? No. Even had one flying fauna, but it had aggressive sentinels. Insane. So yeah, the hunt continues. If you do find a candidate, try and DM either myself, Ricey, or Cynical. And I'm saying DMers, don't put it on some social media, don't put it on the Discord. Because if we do choose to use it, that means the portal code's out there for everyone, doesn't it? You know? And we're going to be doing that MS Teams form this time to sort of cut out a, a few people that trolled the event that might be lurking inside of our Discords. Yeah. Anyway, until next time, goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again. Thank you for backing my channel. Patreon for over 30 months. Thank you from Captain Steve. Thank you, Adam. Adam Mac, Mac Adam, Adam Mac. Salute Mundo Cool. Thank you. Adam Mac, Mac Adam, Adam Mac. Mac, Mac Adam, Adam Mac, Adam Mac. Thank you for backing my channel. Patreon for over 30 months. Thank you from Captain Steve. Thank you, Adam. Adam Mac, Mac Adam, Adam Mac. Salute Mundo Cool. Thank you. Adam Mac, Mac Adam, Adam Mac. Mac, Mac Adam, Adam Mac.